The Rutgers wrestling squad is loaded with former New Jersey high school state champions. As the Scarlet Knights prepare for the Big Ten tournament this weekend, some of the athletes pause to reflect on what their high school accomplishments meant to them. Winning the title in Jersey is like so special. Uh, not many states have one state tournament. A lot of them have multiple state tournaments and multiple uh, classes depending on how big your school is. So New Jersey is all one and winning that state tournament means you're the best in the state. And Growing up as a little kid, you go to you go to the state tournament usually if you're one of the better wrestlers or you're from a town that is known for wrestling like South Plainfield is. And I've watched all the state tournaments and I always wanted to be on the on the center mat wrestling in front of all those fans. And when I was finally my time to go do it, uh, it was a unique feeling. And even though my goals are so are so high, I mean, you're definitely able to enjoy it. And when you got 10,000 people going crazy for you and you're just running around the mat and adrenaline's taking over, yeah, you definitely get to enjoy it. Honestly, the second time was just as good as the first. I think, uh, I thought it was like great. You know, I spazzed out. Uh, it was a great, great place, great environment. I loved it, a bunch of people, a bunch of fans. So uh, I had a great time doing it. That experience is just something else, man. Wrestling in Boardwalk Hall and just knowing you're the best guy in New Jersey, it's, it's pretty awesome. It's not like other states where you got four state title, four state champs. Uh, it's one state champion, so when you win it, you're the best guy. You're the man, basically. How soon after the first victory are you thinking about the next year? I mean, I probably took like a week off, and then I was right back to it. So, immediately. <laughs> and getting it done a second time, it's just, I felt like it was harder. Like, I had to push myself more in, in the training than the first time. I knew I had to do something more to stay on top. I didn't want to lose, lose in the finals or lose after winning it. So I worked, it pushed me to work harder every day in the room.